Hi, my name is Kaylin Chapman. Today we'll be doing an experiment to demonstrate how to use a calorimeter. In front of me you can see three different types of calorimeters. For this experiment, you will need a thermometer, a burette to measure water, you'll need calcium chloride, and you'll also need ammonium nitrate. A calorimeter is a device that measures the transfer of heat between two substances. It determines the energy that is lost or gained by the aqueous environment as a result of the chemical or physical change. Using the data we collect today, we can use the equation Q equals MC delta T to calculate the specific heat of an object. To begin this experiment, you will want to measure out 10 milliliters of water. You will put that 10 milliliters of water into your calorimeter. You will want to use your thermometer or your temperature probe to take the initial temperature of that water. Our initial temperature is around 19 degrees Celsius. Now that we have our initial temperature, we can add our calcium chloride. We will be adding 3 grams of calcium chloride to our calorimeter. Our final temperature was 23.0 degrees Celsius. For the next trial, we will be using ammonium nitrate. We will need to measure out 10 milliliters of water to put in the calorimeter. And we will add 3 grams of ammonium nitrate. We will first measure the initial temperature of the water. The initial temperature is about 20 degrees Celsius. We will now add our 3 grams of ammonium nitrate. As you can see on the graph, there is an immediate temperature drop. The final temperature of the reaction can be measured at 4.6. The trial involving calcium chloride would be an exothermic reaction because the system loses heat and the surroundings heat up. The trial with ammonium nitrate would be an endothermic reaction because the system gains heat as the surroundings cool down. That is it for this video. If you would like to know how to calculate your results of your experiment, go to the next video. Thank you.